Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving deep into one of the most debated topics in nutrition, carbs and weight loss. If you've ever wondered how many carbs you should eat to shed those extra pounds, this video is for you. Let's get started by understanding the basics. Carbohydrates are a primary source of energy for our bodies, but not all carbs are created equal. There are simple carbs like sugar and complex carbs like those found in whole grains and vegetables. To lose weight, many experts recommend reducing your carb intake. This can help decrease your hunger and make it easier to cut down on calories without feeling deprived. So, how many carbs should you eat daily to lose weight? The answer isn't one size fits all. It depends on factors such as your age, sex, body type, and activity level. For most people, a low carb diet means consuming less than 120 grams of carbs per day. The dietary guidelines for Americans suggest that carbs should make up 45% to 65% of your daily calorie intake. But if weight loss is your goal, cutting back below 120 grams a day might be beneficial. Why eat fewer carbs? Studies show that low carb diets can help reduce your appetite, leading to fewer calories consumed and more weight loss. In fact, some research suggests that low carb diets can lead to better weight loss results compared to low fat diets, at least in the short term. Other benefits include improved blood sugar levels, lower blood pressure, and reduced insulin levels. These diets can help decrease water retention, which can lead to quick drop in weight initially. Before we move on, if you're finding this information helpful and want tips on living a healthier lifestyle, please consider subscribing to our channel. We love having you here as part of our community and your support helps us create more content that you enjoy. Plus, you'll never miss out on our latest health and wellness advice. It's essential to understand that everyone's body is different. Experiment with different amount of carbs to see what works best for you. Don't just follow what a so-called expert, Instagram or fitness influencer says. There is no one size fits all approach. One person might be able to eat a plate of pasta a few times a week and look amazing while someone else might need to limit themselves to a spoon of rice or certain pasta types a few times a week. Factors like activity level, job requirement, and metabolism all play a role. The key takeaway is that lowering your carb intake can help you shed those pounds. But it's crucial to eat a well-balanced meal and get all your nutrients. If you want a video on what you should eat in a day with low carbs to no carbs, let me know in the comments by saying me. Now, let's take a quick break for my daughter's daily joke. What do you call a bear with no teeth? A gummy bear! <laughs> Isn't she the cutest? If you enjoyed that joke, give this video a thumbs up to show some love for our little comedian. There are many types of low carb diets, each with varying degrees of carb restriction. Examples include ketogenic diet, Atkins diet, paleo diet, and South Beach diet. The key is to find one that fits your lifestyle and preferences while keeping your carb intake below the recommended threshold. Not all carbs are bad. Focus on eating high fiber carbs like vegetables, fruits, legumes, and whole grains. Avoid refined carbs and sugars, which can spike your blood sugar and contribute to weight gain. Remember, it's not just about cutting carbs, but also about eating quality foods. Lean meats, fish, eggs, nuts, avocados, and healthy fats should be staples in your diet. The amount of weight you could lose on a low carb diet varies. On average, people can expect to lose about 13 pounds within a year. However, results can differ based on individual factors. One study found that participants on a low-carb diet for 8 weeks lost significantly more visceral fat, dangerous belly fat, compared to those on a low-fat diet. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like it. 
your likes and comments help us know what content you love and want more of. Plus, it supports our channel and allows us to continue bringing you great tips and advice. We appreciate each and every one of you and love being a part of your health journey. And here's an exciting update. We're going to start giving away stuff and you don't want to miss out on free goodies. So go ahead and subscribe now and hit the notification bell. Who doesn't want free stuff, right? Join our family and be the first to know about our giveaways. Let's address some common questions. Is 100 gram of carbs a day low carb? Yes, as long as you stay below 150 grams, it can be considered low carb. Can you lose weight on 50 grams of carb a day? Yes, but it depends on your overall diet and activity levels. Is 30 grams of carbs a day okay? This is very restrictive and might not be sustainable for everyone. Consult a healthcare professional before making drastic changes. Before starting a low carb diet, track your current carb intake and focus on healthy fiber rich carb sources. Remember, balance is key to a successful diet. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with anyone who might benefit from this information. Don't forget to subscribe for more health and fitness content. We love sharing these moments with you and are grateful to have you a part of the YouTube family. See you next time.